<laughs> it's second man. place, and Please Tanya Kwiatkowski of the U.S. Melanina. still in the lead. But here is Tatiana Malanina of Uzbekistan in seventh place after the short program. She competed at the Olympics this year and was an eighth place finisher. So a positive season so far for this 25-year-old. And she's really quite wonderful. She has a very precise, traditional kind of skating. Music Aladdin by Alan Menken. Now look at how steady, neat, and clean that was. the free leg on this she did not reach back and it looked as though she didn't even attempt to triple again you've got to go back to looking at the entrance of the jump that will tell you the story of the jump Tatiana, born in Russia, was not a part of the big Moscow St. Petersburg skating schools, coached by her father early on. Moved for six years to Uzbekistan and now is back in Russia. And when you look at this competition, this portion of the 30 skaters involved, seven from former Soviet republics, they're all in the top 13. Just some insight into how successful they've been. And also to the total effect of this breakup of the Soviet Union. Ah, she was off on that one, on the back inside edge. physique and she's slender she moves beautifully on the ice in a very traditional way very straightforward skater She's singling it out. What is happening to these ladies? There, that's right, that's the way to do it. Lay back with a very mediocre position, the free leg bent and not at all stylishly held back or out. I think one of the things you have to remember in the skating world is that you have to be able to be good enough so that when you skate 25% under